what, what were you, what were kind of your limiting beliefs or, um, going into that, right? Like, what were you thinking going into that transition when you first started? Uh, my first limiting belief was I wasn't worth that much. And that's not accurate. My, my uh, skill set and what I'm worth to get paid for is not a purely based on the needs of the customer. They're actually based on my needs first. So if you look at the pricing model that we have, they're actually based on how much knowledge I have, uh, regardless of industry, how much work I've put into learning that, and then the value of the skill to the person who needs it. So I think I had to get over the fact that I'm worth more than $500 for a website. I'm worth way more than that, I'm sure, if I priced it out now. Um, and I'm worth more than I'm worth more than $100 for photo sessions because I did photography as well and cider videos. And I'm worth more than $200 for a video because I bring something else to the table. I don't just bring my camera or my laptop to build a website for somebody. I bring a knowledge base of understanding who they are and taking the time to learn who they are and their needs because they may come to me and say they need a website. Okay, cool. What kind of website? Are you looking just to host your blog and host your articles? Or do you need some page that's like coming straight from Google My Business and saying, I just need a place where people can come and they just call us. Cool. Those two types of websites are very different, right? One is very much just a, a lander getting to know us, letting the customer choose the journey. And the other one's more along the lines of a funnel. Like they've come to me for a specific reason. I'm only going to give them one option and that's the reason they've come. So that's why I, I love funnels a lot more than lander websites because the, you take away the options. You're truly creating a customer journey from start to finish. So 100%. limiting the belief is one, I wasn't worth that much. And two, people way smarter than me, which is true. There are people smarter than me in this industry, but that doesn't negate my skill set. That doesn't negate me as a person. I can still reach up to that level. It may take time. 